We are being called home. We are being called to slow down. We are being called to allow Mother Earth to heal. We are being called to look after ourselves and each other, to think globally, to learn new ways to deal with uncertainty. We are being called to be patient, to be creative and resourceful, and to tap into our inner resilience. During the COVID-19 lockdown, I felt the calling to share art and its medicines with people. So I created a, a series of free uh, painting sessions uh, called Ground with Paint in my Facebook group and also held virtual soulful retreats where we gathered and connected and painted, cried, laughed, um, and allowed ourselves to process what we were experiencing. My name is Melanie Rivers. I'm from the Squamish First Nation in West Vancouver, Canada. My ancestral name is Tieltawit, and I'm a mixed media artist and painter. One of my biggest joys is engaging people in art and creativity, and I do that through online uh, art classes and courses. I believe art has many medicines to share with us, stillness, joy, connection. It's a way to express without words and a way to process uh, and integrate experiences. Don't plan a painting ahead of time. I allow this story to emerge. And I often bring in uh, animals and, and birds uh, and teachings related to my Squamish ancestry. And I'm going to share with you a few of the pieces that I created in these live sessions uh, with women around the world and some of the stories that emerged from them. A quiet sadness, holding, hiding, Soft medicine provides a slow release and a supported heart. Moments of deep fears and anxiety. Moments of simple joys and slowing down. Aliveness and tiredness. Grief and hope. Unknowns and great clarity. Connection and deep missing of loved ones. This duality is present daily, hourly, and moment to moment. I long for the great awakening to come. During this time, we also had uh, a lot of racial tensions uh, happening in the United States and Canada, and the Black Lives Matter movement really was present for us all. Uh, so one of my paintings um, was to honor Black Lives Matters, and her, her story that emerged through this painting was called Listen to Me. This place is ancient. Heartache was here. Joy was here. Love was here. They hold us in their wisdom, the stone people. This time is for transformation, they say to me. Duality holds beautiful shifts through quiet unfurling. Be patient and listen. Listen.